I am about to maiden an RC rocket with wings and I could not be happier. This is the E-Flight F-16 Thunderbirds 70mm 6S Power RC Jet with retracts. Yep, amazing retracts and I am just so excited. All year long, since midsummer I guess, I've been working up to this point, this now being my fifth jet. The progression is real and it is fun. I, <laughs> I'm just pumped to get this thing in the air. We just did a build video on the channel last night. If you guys are thinking about picking one of these up, that build video is there for you. It's very easy to piece together and with our video paired with the instructions, you're gonna get this in the air in less than an hour, no problem. So, charge your batteries, start building your jet, let's maiden this thing. I cannot wait to fly this. I'm excited, nervous, and confident. Uh, we're getting light gusts of wind that I think are just more brutally cold than really anything, and safe is on. So for this flight and my next flight, assuming there's a second, safe will be on. This is 6S power, let's go baby. Oh yeah, there we go. <laughs> I think we need to cut the grass in our field. Okay, I can see this really well. That bright white looks so good. I'm gonna shut up for this pass. <laughs> oh, that looks so good. All right, we're gonna pull up the landing gear on the next pass. Those retracts are gonna look great. This thing sounds so good. On that next pass, Abby, that's what we're gonna shoot for. Remember, safe is on, so this is extremely easy to fly right now. It's keeping it super smooth and level for me. No rolling over. So here we go. Retracts going up. There they are. Very nice. This looks like a real jet now. <laughs> okay we're just cruising on the throttle for now so we're going to do some high speed passes after i get a good feel for this jet oh my gosh yeah that was not even maybe 60 percent don't get throttle. it that close okay i know that was camera, crazy that was a little rough so we're pulling this a little bit farther out i'm going to juice it on this pass are you ready yeah here we go here's full throttle on a 6s jet nice and centered over the runway Let's get a little bit closer to us and maybe a little bit lower. Wow, I'm not even touching rudder yet, you guys. Jeez. Yeah, I want y'all to get a feel I for that. I have to that. zoom all the way out if I'm <laughs> staying a chance of following that. Not really helping the video, but I'm having fun. Here we go. One more high speed pass. And we pull up some. Nice. I think I'm ready to take safe off. I did not assign it to a switch. Have you lost me, Abby? There, I got gotcha. you. Okay. I didn't assign it to a switch just because I wanted it on the whole flight. Look at this. Wow, that thing is sweet. Now I've heard a lot of people say that this outperforms the Viper. When they saw my unboxing, I got a lot of cool feedback from you guys, and I am excited to turn safe yes. off on both of these and get a feel for 
almost borderline Harriers. I've seen people do some really cool stuff with this. More of a performance jet than the Viper. And it feels good, and oh my gosh, it looks just amazing, doesn't it? Yeah, it's really cool. This is by far the peak of the iceberg on my fleet of jets. This is just awesome. Look at that. And I'm not juicing it full throttle to do that pass. It's just a nice speed that I feel pretty comfortable with. This is so cool, you guys. Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh man, here on my channel, we, we can't um. afford our channel. We cannot afford the sound effects. So you guys get the awesome Nate sound effects. And Abby <laughs> completely missing the plane. Oh, my oh gosh. I'm sorry. Abby. I'm getting a little too close for a jet that's so fast for Abby. Give it up for Abby for keeping up with this really sweet jet on the video. Oh man, okay, so with Safe On, this bank that I'm in right now is the tightest I can turn it. That will not let me roll over anymore. When I go left, again, I'm almost vertical, you know, on that wing. That's as tight as it'll let me turn. Now let's test and see my elevation, right? My, uh, my elevator and see how steep it'll let me climb. I've not even tested that yet. So here on this pass, when we get about mid, I'm gonna juice it up. You ready? Three, two, one, up. So it'll actually let me climb really steep, really fast. We're gonna test the nose down dive on this pass. So be ready, Abby. You're nosing down? Nosing down. Three, two, one. This is full down and full back. So that is the steepest it'll let me climb, which is actually very steep for being in safe, but I still feel very comfortable. So on this pass, what I'm gonna do is pull back really quick again uh, with a little more heads up. Okay, three, two, one, pulling up, and I'm holding full elevator. Okay, I'm gonna level off, and we're just gonna coast it now. This is zero throttle. Checking out stall tendencies with safe on. Not something I'd recommend. We're gonna kick the throttle back on, but it's not like it fell out of the sky completely, so I'm pretty happy with that. This thing is a breeze to fly, and wow, so much fun. Look at this thing. Oh, baby. <laughs> okay, I need to check my flight time. You're at maybe almost five minutes. Yeah, very close. Let's drop the retracts now. Retracts are down. Nice. Yeah, they look so good. And we're gonna land coming in from that corner toward us. I'm gonna stay here with you, Abby. The beeping you hear is my timer telling me that we've hit five minutes, which is a probably pretty good recommended flight time for the battery that we have in here. All of this stuff will be linked in the description box below. We're at zero throttle and we're just gonna coast in here. And oh yeah, that was just perfect. I will take that every single time. Let's taxi it in here. See how it does on fairly tall grass. We do need to cut our grass. That's why it took a while to get in the air, but it taxis great and I have another battery. So let's fly this thing. Well, the wind is coming in from a different direction now. It's shifting directions a lot today. So we're gonna start off down there and hopefully you guys can see it lift off close to us. So let's do this. We're gonna do a fast flight so that we can save some juice for those awesome slow motion shots that you guys are enjoying. Here we go. Takes it a second to uh, eat through our tall grass here at our field. It does need mode, but it does it no problem. Landing gear up. Oh yeah. Let's do a couple fast passes as I said. 
then we'll do one more landing. The best part of all these videos is the takeoff and landing anyway, right guys? So <laughs> you get more of that in this video. Here we go, full throttle. So awesome, so awesome. Let's do one more pass this way and then we'll land it and save some juice for our fun slow-mo shots. Here we go, full throttle. Oh, I was ahead of it and totally screwed that one up. <laughs> You're okay. You're okay. Does that mean you want one more? Yeah. Okay. One more pass, then we'll land it. That'll work out perfectly for my approach anyway. High speed pass. Here we go. Okay, we'll bleed off some speed here on this curve. We'll drop the landing gear out over Death Valley. Landing gear down. I see three wheels. That's perfect. What we'll do, because the wind is now to our backs, is bring it in right in between that tree line here. So with this jet, I'm seeing that we wanna just bleed off a lot of speed. Remember, we don't have flaps. So we're gonna let it drop down, get it to where I can actually see everything. This is where I'm gonna line up on the runway, kill the throttle completely, and let it touch down. Yeah. Wow! Glassed it, greased it, whatever you wanna say. That, that was, was perfect. Good. I'm happy, wow! Woo, that is fun to fly. And what'd you guys think of those landings, especially that second one? I'm, maybe I just got lucky, but this thing just came in so perfectly, especially for a jet having no flaps. I think this is a blast, and that's just on safe flight mode. And I'm very easy to fly on this mode too, boosting my confidence enough to not really be super nervous to get this in the air. After having flown the Viper and now going to this, and just from people's feedback on our build video, I knew we were gonna have a good time. I didn't know we'd have this much fun. That makes me excited to assign my safe to a switch and turn that off and have some crazy acrobatic maneuver fun on an upcoming video. Well, having said that, if you guys wanna pick up one of these for yourself, I'd say you're a very smart person. And if you wanna do that, we'll have it linked for you in the description box below. Now, here's the important thing. For this jet, we have a very highly recommended battery. That's gonna be linked down there too. And our favorite transmitter paired with the jet. All that good stuff. If you decide to get any one of those things or all of those things, please use our link. It helps our channel out. This content for you is free and it ain't free for us to make. Also, electricity is expensive. Keep these batteries full for us. Thank you, please. <laughs> Guys, it's so much fun what we do, but we couldn't do it without your views and your help. If you want to be a patron supporter, that's amazing. But as we say, those links go a long way. This jet is a must have, a head turner, and just an amazing performer. There will be more of this content on the channel. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. This is where I'm gonna line up on the runway, kill the throttle completely, and let it touch down. Yeah. Wow.